So uh, I came to a point in my life where I realized I have invested a huge amount of time in my professional development, but I had not really invested time in my faith walk and my relationship with uh, God and with Christ is important to me. And it struck me that that was perhaps upside down. I, I grew up evangelical. My husband and I converted in 1996. And so the hunger deepened to understand uh, more about scripture, more about what the Catholic Church has to offer. Well, I've always had an interest in adult catechesis. And I had been a volunteer adult catechist uh, periodically throughout my career. One of the things that uh, I would like to do is uh, serve as a director of faith formation. I'm a deacon in the Archdiocese of Seattle. My pastor had asked me to help him with adult education. And I wondered, could I do this? Do I know my faith well enough to stand before others and be able to explain it to them? Uh, before I came to CDU, I have a master's degree already. And uh, I could say unequivocally that uh, CDU is absolutely the best, one of the best educational experiences that I've ever been personally involved in. The one thing that's really nice about um, using Catholic Dis Distance University is that I can utilize their resources on, when it's most convenient to me. Um, as a busy mother with a, a, a very active lifestyle, I can go online when I am, when it works best for me. We're talking about a personal relationship. You can't love someone really unless you get to know them. And what you really are looking for is the truth about that person. I must admit, uh, probably the most transformational part of my faith walk through the CDU experience was reading all of the documents from Vatican II. Th that there's a universal call to holiness. Everybody has a role and we embrace that role and we all have a contribution. And I would hope that the bishops of our country will be able to see that CDU is a tool that they can access for the formation of not only their deacons, but also their catechists and other religious teachers. Delivering truth with the fullness of love is what Jesus did for us. And so um, I think CDU really equips you to be able to do that. You see God's great love in his truth. I do think that it's something that diocese should look at very seriously. Um, I believe every catechist should really utilize this source. It's uh, invaluable. So when you engage a curriculum like CDUs and you just let it work on you, even as you're working on it, you'd be surprised. You suddenly, there's a different person looking at you in the mirror than when you started. That's a powerful evangelizing tool. There's true joy in truth, in knowing the truth. Uh, the responsibility that you have as an individual to um, share that truth with other people. It's beautiful and it's contagious. As you reach out as a catechist, even to young children, um, God opens doors for you to reach out to their families too. Knowledge is given to be shared. And I think that when we can share the truth with others, then we experience a deep and abiding joy, a joy for ourselves and a joy for them. If you have a hand in allowing someone to go from a very basic rudimentary understanding of their faith and that more advanced knowledge helps that individual know Christ better, that has to be a treasure that uh, God himself is pleased with. If you're interested in Catholic education, you have to first educate the educators. If you want the faith to be adequately presented to our culture in our time, then you have to go out and support those institutions of higher education that are presenting the faith authentically. By making a contribution to CDU and keeping this outstanding program going, you keep the tools sharpened that are going to produce literally 
generations of, of catechists, uh, generations of informed, devout, fervent Catholics who are better prepared to, uh, to uh, evangelize the culture around us, which it so badly needs. I think that um, the investment into Catholic Distance University and the coursework, the knowledge, the truth that they're passing on is changing the world. There's an opportunity to participate in this educational program at multiple levels. So the faculty have the content, the students obviously bring their enthusiasm and commitment. And then you do need individuals and organizations who are willing to provide the resources so that we can do it. It will go on forever and ever. As you give that gift to your children, and they pass it on to their children and their children. And so it, it really is an investment. It's an internal investment.